Okay, ladies, so here we go with a new outray lace front. This one is called 3C Whirly, and she is available at Sam's Beauty. This one here is in the color number two. It does have the combs in the front and an adjustable strap in the nape area. And as you can see, these curls are very, very tight. Okay, super duper tight. But we're gonna work this to the best of our ability. So, the first things first, I did notice that there really isn't any lace on this. It's probably like a quarter of an inch. So being that it's so big, I'm really not worried about not being able to part it because this is a lot, a lot of hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and place these combs where they need to be and pull out some of my hair in the front because of course we are going to have to hide that lace wig edge. We don't want that boxy hairline. So the best thing to do is a little bit of hair. What I'm using here is Topic Hair Building Fibers, which I use in all of my videos. It is for anyone who has balding spots, thin edges, or wants their hairline to look a lot thicker, which is great for when you are putting on a wig. Makes your hairline look flawless, baby, and flawless it is. Um, that product is available at Sam's, I'm uh, not, excuse me, not Sam's, but Sally's Beauty and also Target.com. So I am just going to finger comb this unit. I am going to finger comb her all the way to where I want her to be styled. I really don't think it's best to use a comb with her because she is a little bit tightly curled and of course it will get a little bit frizzy so you don't want to get carried away with the comb so I suggest finger combing her. I did put a little mousse on her by Cream of Nature and this is also for my hair in the front. Now you see it's a little bit longer than even in the back. It's not as pictured so I'm going to go ahead and start cutting it. I did want to keep the length but being that it was kind of uneven and choppy in the back area I said you know what let's just cut it and make our own style. Cut it and shape it. And you pretty probably can shape it with the length of it at original length, but me personally, I'm just going to cut it and shape it. I love kinky curly hair now, and 3C Whirly is a great mimic of 3C hair texture. The curls in this unit, like I said, are tight, and once you finger comb them, they get even more natural looking, so it, don't, it doesn't look synthetic at all, especially once you went ahead and finger combed it. The best thing that I can suggest would be to definitely, definitely do not wear it straight out the pack. I'm going to put a little bit of my edge control on it, which is by Even New York. This is a 24-hour extreme firm hold, and I swear by this stuff. And I'm just going to go ahead and keep playing around with this unit and try to make it mine. I'm probably going to look a little crazy in the video because I don't think I have it where I want it to be yet. But let's take a look and see. All right, you guys, so here we go. This is the Outre Big Beautiful Hair, and this is called 3C Whirly. So it's supposed to mimic natural texture hairs. You girls seen, I took and cut off a whole heap of hair because I didn't really like the way it was styled. It was kind of long and just crazy looking, and I wanted to give it um, some shape. There really isn't any parting space. As you've seen, there's like teeny 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 bit it's more or less like the lace edge there's nowhere for you to part it at but because the hair is so big you really don't have to but the wig this wig is going to hold up forever like for real when i say forever because the curls are so tight and you're gonna have to take the time out to really really pick the curls out like finger comb them i'm not gonna say um Get yourself a comb and start raking through. I think finger combing it is the best way because it just looks a little bit more natural. You can get the curls to how you want them to be. And if you want to cut it while you're finger combing it like I'm doing like right here, then I would suggest that. But I wouldn't suggest a comb. Just be patient and just finger curl, fluff her out. Once you finger curl and fluff those tight curls out, it looks so natural. Like 3C Whirly is the perfect... Um, way to describe her. It's very realistic and I don't really think she's going to tangle because she's so tightly curled. But I will be honest and tell you this wig will last you for a minute y'all. Like seriously. I think the older she gets the more natural and realistic she starts looking. Out the pack she is very tightly curled. I would not suggest walking around with them tight curls like that that just came off the perm rods. No. Go ahead and get those fingers ready and those jazz hands, whatever they call them, and start to play with this wig. But 
Let me tell you, the one thing that I wasn't too pleased with was there was no parting with the unit. And it's okay because it's still very full to where if you really wanted to put a part, I'm pretty sure you can tweeze yourself in one. But she's so full that you probably wouldn't even see the part in this unit. She's just that full. I just really think that you need to play around with it a little bit and cut and finger comb it and style it to your preference. The model looks gorgeous on it. Um, she looks gorgeous in the unit, but it was a little bit too much for me. I didn't like the length of it because it was so wild. It was kind of like uneven, kind of choppy when it came to the cutting. So that is the reason why I decided to get my scissors out and just start cutting away. And if you want a wig that's going to last you forever, then this one has got to be it by far. So you can go ahead and check out samsbeauty.com. I'll post all the information for this unit below. Let me know what you think of 3C Whirly. This is in the color number two. Um, and what are your thoughts on kinky curly wigs? Would you rock them? How do you feel about them? And on that note, I will see you girls on my next video. Stay diva and divalicious as always. And make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe.